Morocco has, has a very open and engaged approach to the environmental challenges that the whole world is facing. We're all facing climate change, we're all facing nature loss, and we're all facing pollution and waste. And the only way that we can face it is by owning up to the challenges and then stepping into meeting these challenges. And this score, I would say that I'm very impressed with what Morocco is doing. If we begin by the climate story, which is of course a story that Morocco hasn't created, Morocco is in a sense uh, uh, seeing the impact of CO2 emissions by other nations. But being a coastal economy, being a country that lives with dry periods and, and deserts and desertification, Morocco understands the importance of taking action as a climate leader. And there I was very, very pleased to visit in Wazazat, the Noor projects, where we see the audacious and the brave and the bold investments that Morocco made over 10 years ago, today the second largest solar plant in the world, and really showing the world that the sun will be an energy source if we just let it, if we just invest in it. And similarly on biodiversity, which is another crisis that we are losing globally, our biodiversity, we're seeing Morocco leaning in. Morocco has a program of investing in forests and forest, uh, afforestation, reforestation, with a goal of investing and having 600,000 additional hectares of forest just by 2030, a few years out. That again is very bold and brave, but the right thing to do. Again, we have to accept that you know, forest fires are a function of, of, of climate change, and so we have to continue this process. 